Hi children, today's story is called Henry and Boo by Megan Bruez. Let's get started. Henry didn't know where Boo had come from. He simply arrived one day. Henry was having a nice cup of tea and the next thing he knew, there was Boo right next to the teapot. Do you see where Boo was at? He's at on the table saying, Boo. Look at Henry's face, he's so surprised. Do you guys notice what it says on the newspaper? Wanted, dangerous bear. Hmm. Henry asked him to leave. Okay, goodbye. But Boo just said, Boo. I see what Boo does. And everywhere Henry went, Boo went too. And Boo said, Boo, Mr. Chameleon, yes, I wonder, why does he keep saying Boo? Hmm, let's find out. You see, Henry is hiding behind a tree, but Boo still found him. Let's see what happens on the next page. Boo, look at them. Yes, they're upside down. Children, can you do the same thing that Henry and Boo is doing? Let's see. Oh, that is fantastic. You guys did a great job doing that. And everything Henry did, Boo did too. And Boo said, Boo. So as we see, Henry is making a cake and Boo is sitting there with a the spoon. And Henry is washing dishes and Boo is right there by the sink saying Boo. And Henry's vacuuming. And yes, you're right, Mr. Chameleon. He is on top of the vacuum cleaner, which is so much fun, children. So if you've got a chance to do that, it is so much fun to do. Henry tried to ignore Boo. You're right, Chameleon. That's hard to do, to ignore somebody, but he keeps saying Boo. And yes, you're right, Mr. Chameleon. They are a garden. I wonder what kind of things that they're gonna plant. In a garden, you could do flowers, you could do fruits and vegetables. I like to do um, oranges and bananas and roses. Those are nice to a plant. You're right, you, you're definitely right, Mr. Chameleon. I see him in the cart saying Boo again. I wonder where they're gonna go. But Boo just kept saying Boo. Okay guys, say Boo too, Boo. And look what Henry is doing. Henry is ignoring and watering the plants. Yes, I see him too, Mr. Chameleon. He's holding up his plant for Henry to water it. Boo is saying Boo? <gasps> what do I see by the tree? You guys, you see them children? You see the bear? He's hiding behind the tree. And the tree said, bears keep out. I wonder what the bear's gonna do. Let's see. So Henry tried to hide. I'm not here. But Boo just said, Boo. You guys, have you ever hide in a box before? Oh yes, it is so much fun to do. In fact, Boo said boo a lot, and I mean really a lot. Boo, 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 boo. And quite frankly, Henry had enough. Boo was driving him nuts. Yes, I totally agree with you, Mr. Chameleon. It would be very hard to go to sleep if somebody keeps saying boo, boo, boo. Just when Henry had thought of a brilliant solution, brilliant solution in his boo problem, well, Mr. Chameleon, brilliant means like a great idea. So when you have a great idea, you call it a brilliant solution. So he's writing on a box somewhere far, far away. What do you think is gonna happen to Boo? Ah, a bear, it looks fierce and it seems so hungry. And Harry felt quite faint. Oh, you ask what does faint mean? Faint means where you feel like you're about to pass out. But yes, you're right, Mr. Chameleon. The bear is saying yum. He didn't see the sign that said bears keep out. <gasps> oh no, what do you think is gonna happen to Mr. Henry and Boo? Boo! Said Boo, eek, says the bear. <gasps> yes, you're right, the bear looks scared now and Boo is scaring him away. Goodbye, bear. Boo, 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 boo. Where? And the scary old bear fled. Fled means you like you're going away. Look at that. Henry looks happy. 
and Boo looks tough. He got that strong face on him. Boo, Boo, Boo. I think I like you, Boo. And Boo said, Boo, uh, what a great hug. The end. Children, thank you for joining us. And we look forward to reading you a story again. Have a good one.